what's up everybody happy merry vlogmas day one what's up we made it december 1st so actually this video was filmed on the 29th so i'm gonna be a day behind you guys are gonna get these videos the day after on youtube so it is what it is but anyway guys merry freaking christmas i hope everybody had an awesome fantastic thanksgiving and i hope everybody's holiday season is great so today is wednesday november 30th and you guys are gonna see this video on the first, so Vlogmas Day 1. It is 7.39 a.m., just dropped my kids off at school. Well, my son off at the bus stop. It was raining today, so I sat with him in the car and let him get on the bus, and then I dropped my daughter off at school. So now I'm gonna go ahead and photograph. I'm gonna start photographing uh, my daily 25. We'll see how far I get. I think I could get about 10 to 15 of those done before I have to get ready to go to the bins. I got about a 30 minute drive to the bins. Um, and then yeah, so I don't know if I'm gonna put any footage of the bins in I might grab some clips on my phone and just throw it up so you guys can see like the bad dash it is half off day so It's crazy on half off day I go to the bins three to four times a week because that's where I get the cheapest inventory and the most inventory so Might hit a local thrift store today, too. I don't really know ignore my house. It is kind of dirty, but you know we're parents we live in our house Usually we clean it up on the weekends. So just gonna take you guys through every day uh, from now until Christmas. So get ready for content because it's gonna be happening once a day, every day. Let's get it. All right, this is the inventory rack that I have. Uh, I'm gonna be processing from here up. Got my first one up. Those are just some kids Adidas joggers. But yeah, guys, we're gonna be growing together. During this month of December, I'm gonna be revamping this entire garage. Right now I have two of these large uh, these are husky husky racks. They're the, the four shelf uh, I'm definitely gonna end up being able to get about three more of these in here once I finish I think what I'm gonna try to do I have to measure it out But I want to put two racks on this wall and then move my photo station in the middle of the two racks Have a rack coming this way with another rack coming this way and then one on the other side of that So five total I'm gonna move like right here. This is all extra storage like I said, do we have a lot in here? I'm actually gonna be buying like a little storage shed for outside, I think. Not like a big one, but like, I think they're like three or 400 bucks. Little plastic ones with the, the plastic floor. I'm gonna put it on some pavers uh, just to get some of this stuff out of the garage. Like just like the lawnmower, you know, the weed eater, all the rakes and stuff that are up on the wall over there. Uh, maybe the kids' bikes. My son doesn't even ride his bike, so that's probably gonna go in there. And then it's just going to open up a lot of space. And then I'll have three red racks. Those two are going to stay there. And then the other one is probably going to go, hopefully, on the other side. So when you open the garage, you have to open the garage to get to that rack. But it's just going to be a lot of stupid stuff, miscellaneous stuff on it. Um, but yeah, this table is probably going to be going away. Not going away, but like, you know, I'm going to move it. I'm pro this right here is a dirty, a really, really dirty table. I use it to whatever, I have a deep fryer, so whenever we deep fry stuff, I put it on there or, or like, you know, tailgating stuff. And then I use it to dry shoes when I, when I wash them. So I don't really want to get rid of that, or I don't really want to use that as an everyday. So I'm probably going to go buy another four foot, another four footer um, and stick it here with a dedicated spot for the box. This TV might get like remounted farther over or somewhere else. I don't know. Um, not a big deal though. Uh, the only thing about moving this bad boy onto this wall is my little my little shelf right here that I keep my lint rollers. My this is where I set my phone every time I photograph in between photograph sessions and then my stick. I gotta move all this stuff around. So it's gonna be a lot, guys. It is gonna be a lot. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and start taking these photos so I can get as many done before I go to the bins And then we will check back in later I should probably mention to you guys that I've noticed some changes in my in in my business and the way I process things Biggest thing that I stopped doing was I used to always have on that TV out in the garage I used to always have some sort of YouTube video on while I was working while I was photographing all that stuff I've since cut that out uh, every once in a while I'll listen to a podcast or um, some some audiobooks on business stuff like that on the Alexa out there and it's completely 100% changed my game I'm faster I don't get distracted it's uh, awesome so I know people like background noise but my biggest thing for you I know I'm gonna say this and 
uh, it might hurt my channel a little bit, I don't know, but I really enjoy you guys watching me, but if you are really trying to grow your business and, and, and scale up, maybe cut the YouTube out while you're working, or at least some of it, I don't know, just my two cents, but anyway, just wanted to tell you guys that real quick, uh, gotta get ready, I got 10 uh, sets photographed, Got 15 more to do when I get home. I can knock those out really quickly, but I've got to make sure I get to the bins at a reason, at a reasonable time, so I can get a spot and a cart and get my my stuff. So anyway, I'll check back in with you guys later. Beautiful Christmas tree. Doesn't have a lot of presents under it yet, but it's getting there. All right, guys. So just got back from the bins. It is dark out here. Let me put this light on. So I spent like $22 at the bins today. <laughs> the best part about it was I found $20 in somebody's jacket pocket that they donated in a Columbia jacket. I put it on my Instagram stories. If you don't follow me, I'm going to put it up right now. Whatever. Instagram, follow me on there because uh, I do do a lot of daily content or I'm going to start doing a lot of daily content there just in the stories. So basically I spent like $2 so it was almost free for that pile right there. This pile right here came from my local goodwill a pair of jeans a pair of pants and then like a bunch of t-shirts um i sell a lot of t-shirts on ebay and poshmark guys um but like as i st start moving forward I'm probably going to cut back on the t-shirts because i buy a lot um <clears throat> and a lot of them are not high valued if i can sell it for 10 and i can buy it for $1.50 uh i like that but it doesn't always happen so i'm just focusing on ones that i know i can I can flip for good profit, um, so I might have to leave some behind, but that's okay. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and, like I said earlier, I still got to hit these 15 photos because I've done 10. I got to do 15 more. I've got to edit this video for tomorrow, and then also I had a haul video that I I guess I had already edited. Uh, I thought, I, I don't know how I got mixed up, but anyway, I'm going to film a haul video with that with that stuff that I got today, and then I'm gonna put that out today, uh, probably tonight, so, yeah, that'll be, what, one, two, three, four consecutive days of, <laughs> of vlogging, so, there you go, and then I got some reels to make, but, uh, yeah, guys, anyway, appreciate you, appreciate you making it this far, I know I'm rambling a lot, uh, I'm trying to figure out how I wanna progress with the daily content so I'm not doing the same thing over and over again but it might be the same thing over and over again I don't know but I'll try to show you some brands um, and some stuff some cool things we'll, we'll chat it up we'll talk about life love happiness everything all that BS and yeah so I'll check back in with you guys in a little bit all right I lied about the haul video today I just don't have enough time I'm not trying to stress myself out trying to put a video out today so everything I just said scratch that I just finished my photos it is 12.53, I have to go draft those, list those, cross post those. Then I have to pick my daughter up at 2.15. Um, I think we're going out to dinner tonight. We planned on doing something for dinner tonight. And then I have to edit this video, the first Vlogmas video, to get it out tomorrow. So, I think I'm just going to end this here, guys. Um, maybe tomorrow's video, Vlogmas Day 2. I'll do a bit of a haul. That, that could be cool. So yeah, that, that's what I think I'm going to be doing. Yeah, doing a haul video tomorrow. Yeah, so stay tuned for Vlogmas Day 2. Doing the haul video. Appreciate each and every one of you. No, it's short. Content all over the place. I've just got a lot going on. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for the haul video tomorrow. I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Wear your seatbelt. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>